bao nhiêu người trong nhà chị bao nhiêu người hiện tại giờ có ai trong nhà không yeah. Yes, go, come stand out here, please. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. 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 Wait, wait, wait. Let's stop right there. It's not what you think it is. I'm gonna go over the whole story so you understand why this happened, why everybody, including the grandparents, the owners, the children, everybody got evicted out. So let's get into detail. Hello guys, welcome back to the Eviction Guys channel, okay? Um, I have a very important subject today I'm gonna go on over. Um, and this subject, a lot of people make this mistake and hopefully you guys stay tuned and watch through the whole video and it will help you by not make the same mistake and this eviction case I'm going to go over is one of the landlord that I represent um, they basically make this made this mistake and it cost them uh, to do evictions evict, not even the tenant and also evict himself out of the house okay so please before I get into the subject uh, support this channel by subscribe, like, and share this video, okay? All right, let's get into detail. So, um, this landlord came to my office and uh, asked for help because he uh, rented out a studio, um, a, a room in his house that uh, the tenant does not pay and also... Um, does not vacate be of this property after the mutual termination agreement that they both agreed on okay and and they don't know what to do they can't for my help so when I reviewed this case I saw that um, the owner lease agreement uh, listed that the tenant is living in the property um, he did not state it the room on this lease agreement he just put down his his whole uh, home address on there um, when people do that that mean when I started this evictions the sheriff uh, will come out and do the lockout they're gonna have to do the lockout for the whole house because he did not list it down what room the tenants stay in okay so that's where I am gonna go over the video later on during the eviction as you see the chef they came and they evicted out not only the tenant but any member inside the family everybody gotta be out uh, during the lockout because they are there to evict everybody based on the instruction of the by the court that the whole address okay so Let's get back to the mutual termination agreements is that um, because the tenant did not pay uh, rent and the owner is having a negotiation, a, an agreement with the tenant that if you move out by this date, let me see what date they put down here. Sorry about that. Okay, so they put down here, if they, uh, both tenant and landlord, which is the owner, agree that this, the, this lease will terminate it on April 10th of 2022. 
So that's the last day that the tenant have to be out um, and surrender the keys. Uh, Any time before that, the tenants still need to continue paying their original rent. Um, so during that, at that time, the tenant refused to move. Um, and they still staying there so because we have this mutual termination agreement is a strong enough evidence uh, to to start the eviction so I submitted this mutual termination agreement along with the contract to our uh, to our attorney office and started the evictions uh, we, we write up the complaint and we filed the complaint and we summon we serve the tenant for the unlawful detainer paperwork and after uh, five days the tenant did not respond um, the tenants did not respond so we automatically won by default and we got judgment right here okay um, after we got the judgment we sent it over to the sheriff office and because you know nowadays every sheriff department is you know a swamp with eviction case so it took a little bit longer than uh, it took like three and a half week for the sheriff to come out to do the lockout and uh, on the day of lockout um, the sheriff came myself uh, came and we we started the, the lockout and we have to ask everybody out as you can see in the video um, later is that uh, the family member the grandparents the children everybody got to be out I, I i know it's just we only evicting the tenant but since the mistake that the landlord did is that they did not list down the room the exact room um that the sheriff can go in and evict so the, we have to ask everybody out they 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 escort everybody out after the lockout then the owners um are are free to to let anybody back inside the house okay but you know, I, I feel I feel really bad for the, uh, the 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 grandpa. It's very old, but he have to stand outside. Um, so after they walk out, everybody's clear. The lockout is done. It's it's it's, it's clear. And then everybody can go back inside. Um, so a lesson learned here is that uh, if you do rent out a studio or a room inside your unit, um, make sure to label on the door. You know, label it room one, two, three, or four. You know, and that way, and then on your contract, list down the tenant. If they renting room two, for example, list down the address and then room two. That way, um, this will never happen to you if you ever end up uh, doing evictions lockout. Okay, um, so there it, there it is. Uh, if you like my video, um, the eviction is complete. If you like my video, please help me by share, like, and comment down below. You know, let me know um, what uh, question you have or what type of other eviction question you have. Let me know. I might, uh, I might have similar eviction case that I can make uh, to go over that way and help you answer your questions. Okay? Thank you, and I see you next time. Bao nhiêu người trong nhà chị? Bao nhiêu người hiện tại giờ có ai trong nhà không? Yeah. Four. And can they all hear from right here? So if I yell just have, have, have them all yeah. come out. Yeah. Everybody. Yeah. Okay. Behind the map. This way. Map. This way. Just come. Have, have them all come this way. Come out. Yes. Come, come, come stand out here, please. Yeah. Uh -huh. My gap, you. Yeah. Didn't die, sir. Yeah. Uh -huh. Go gap, cho bác không lấy cái gap cho. Get get a slipper for. Yeah. Lấy lấy. Đỡ, 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 từ từ, từ từ thôi, từ từ, từ từ, từ từ, slow down, ok.
Try and find them a good spot in the shade. Yeah, that's honestly the only spot to stay in. Đỡ, 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 đỡ bác. Nobody else? Okay. Is Ramona Is Ramona's not here? No, no, she's not there. Okay. She's, not she's on the side, yeah. Uh -huh. She's on the side? She's on the side, yeah. Okay. That, that, so does you it, have to access her specifically from the side? Yeah. Da da da, yeah. Sheriff's Office, occupants of 12520 Mayberry, original lawful eviction of the premises. Come to the door, please. Phải đứng ở ngoài hết Nó phải đuổi hết tất cả mọi người ra Xong rồi chút nó vô sau Có cái chỗ nào mát mát có cái ghế cho bác ngồi á Còn mấy, mấy cái phòng mấy cái phòng kia là phải đi cổng sau hết hả chị nó từ từ trong nhà đó có vô được mấy cái phòng đó không nhưng mà chị giúp nó chìm bật chị có chìa khóa hết ba căn đó phải không ok rồi rồi chị mở sẵn hết đi dạ yeah. để có giữ bác chứ giờ bác khỏi đi 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 cho mệt ô ô dạ đứng bên đây nè bên đây nè bên đây nó có cái mát này nè ở ở đằng trước nhà đó
Can you open this door? Mở cửa này man. Is that way? Bác đứng đây nè, bác cho mát nè Anh đây cho mát Bác đứng đây cho mát ha Đây, bác đứng đây cho mát Dạ Okay. Okay, we're good. Thank you. Thank you, sir. You have the paperwork first. Yeah. Yep. Awesome. Yeah, you can go back inside now. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah. You good now, ma'am? You can go back inside, yes. Okay. Okay. So, let's do the agent. This is your copy okay. of the notice of restoration. At this point, the property is restored to you, the agent, and her is the owner. Yes, thank okay. you. Um, Ramona and all the people we think we just kicked out no longer yeah. have tenant rights, specifically yeah. Ramona. Um, if you guys let everybody else back in, that's totally up to you. Okay. Um, Ramona's awesome. lawfully evicted from this, no longer has tenant rights. Anything that's inside, you guys are liable to keep for up to 15 days if it's over a certain dollar amount. Yes. Um, if you have any questions, contact the attorney that helped you with the eviction process, okay? All right, sounds You're not good. not allowed to give you any guys any legal, advice, legal yeah. advice, right? Mm -hmm. So you said you've been through this a bunch yes. of times, so. Um, okay. But we didn't see anything inside, so you guys should be fine. Thank you. Okay, any questions? That's it, yeah. All right, All right, see you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, the tenants is out. They left the couch behind.